Hi, Mira, and welcome to Flow with Mira. We have a quick Pilates workout today, and this class is perfect for the day that you, when you are pressed for time. So let's go ahead, meet me on a mat. We're going to start the class standing. So find yourself standing nice and tall, have your heel directly underneath your sitting bone. <sighs> Softening the knees a little bit for me to start. Take a breath. We're going to start with some spinal roll down. Exhale, let's go ahead and roll the spine down, starting from the tip of the head, the upper back, the middle back, the lower back, folding through the hip, and take your body closer to the floor. In breath. Exhale, go ahead and roll the spine up again, and start stacking up the vertebra, one on top of the other and come up to a beautiful upright position you may straighten the knees in breath one more time exhale roll down soften the knees and take your body closer to the floor and make sure the pelvis is still above your feet inhale at the bottom and an exhale roll up again stacking up the spine all the way to your start position and last one, in breath, softening through the knees and roll down, roll down, roll down. At this time, I want you to place your hands on the floor and then I want you to just bend the knees and transfer your weight down to the floor. So the knees will reach down to the floor and then place your hand directly underneath the shoulder and keep the pelvis somewhere in between the knee and the heels. Opening across the front of the chest, the spine is nice and long. Take an in-breath. Exhale, a little cat curl here, rounding the spine. Curling the tail under. And then flatten long spine. And take the upper back into a slot extension. Exhale, rounding the back. Curling the tail underneath you. And into a long, beautiful flat back. Upper back extend. Two more times. Exhale, rounding, curling, and flat back. Extend the upper back. Last one here. Exhale, rounding and curling, and into a flat back. Extend the upper back and back to that long spine. Right from here, have a sit. Bring your legs forward. Knees are together, feet are together here. Lifting the spine, take an in breath. Exhale, let's go ahead and round the back here. And then roll back through the spine all the way. Take yourself all the way down to the floor and then bring the feet closer towards the bottom. And then half your feet apart. Arms along by the side and release the body down. Moving to our pelvic curl, take an in breath. Exhale, deep in the center, curl the spine up and roll it up all the way up to the bridging position. Press the arms down, lift the pelvis up a little higher. You're gonna feel that hamstring and feel that glute muscle working, the inner thighs in breath. Exhale, we roll down, roll down. Roll down and release. Again, exhale, we roll up, pressing the arms, pressing the feet down, lifting the pelvis a little higher. Keep the abdominal intact. And exhale, roll the spine down all the way back to the floor. Let's do it three more times. Exhale, we roll up, curl up, press the pelvis up. Press the chest up, keep the abdominals drawn in towards the spine, and we roll back down. Two more times, please. We breathe out, we roll up, pressing up, opening across the front of the chest, in breath. Exhale, we roll down. Last one, and exhale, we roll up again. Press the pelvis, lifting up, lifting up, lifting up, and we roll back down. Okay, now from here, take an in breath. Exhale, glide your arms down along the floor, but, and lift the head and the chest up into that chest lift position, 
and in breath take the arms to your ears hands behind your head and come on down exhale lift the head and the chest up inhale hold exhale come down exhale lift in breath hold exhale come down one more exhale lift in breath hold and exhale come down and let's come up again here now hold that inhale take your arms behind your thigh up a little higher reach the arms forward hands next to each other at the rotation rotate center rotate pelvis is stable in the middle rotating from the waistline so i wanted to think about rotation and flexing which is coming up off the floor a little bit more and flex and come up rotate from the waist and lift center rotate center one more each side rotate center last one center hold release the arm place the arms on the side of your pelvis stretch one leg long second leg long squeeze in the legs together and let's roll up pull up the center lift up and over into the seeker position feeling the spine elongating but still honoring that c curve we roll back 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 arms overhead again arms up head lift chest lift and up and over forward into the c curve in breath exhale we roll back down again arms overhead again two more arms chest up and curl up into that c curve in breath exhale we roll down and over last one forward up and over into that c curve and hold on that c curve bend the knees drag the feet closer towards your pelvis grab the shin bone just above the ankle ready for rolling like a ball use your arm muscles here hold the shape of the legs and the spine and let's go in breath exhale forward and in breath exhale forward three more in breath exhale forward two more in breath exhale forward last one in breath exhale forward hold bring the legs up to the tabletop hands just underneath the knee there i want you to roll the spine down curling 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 and then bring the knees a little closer to the chest ready for the double leg stretch inhale exhale and in breath exhale hold the height of the chest as you extend the arms and the legs away from each other exhale two more exhale last one single leg stretch please hands on the right knee extend the left leg forward we switch up a little higher perhaps three three two two one one hands on the right knee we stay extend not extend place your hands behind your head rotate for the crisscross we rotate we rotate from the waistline up three three two one back to the center arms long by the side release the head down extend the legs forward ready for the rollover up to the sky press the arms roll the legs over your and dorsiflex the feet separate the leg lower the feet down and roll the spine down anchor the sitting bone down to the floor point the feet reach the leg away and together again we go up and exhale we flex we separate we lower we roll down 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 set the pelvis down point the feet reach away together again two more times up roll over we flex separate we lower we roll back down to the floor we point reach away together last one up 
roll over. We flex separate down and we roll the spine back. Set the pelvis down, point the feet, reach the legs away, bring it up to the sky. Ready for the corkscrew over to me as we inhale. Exhale down and center. Over to you as you in breath. Exhale and center. And to me. Exhale and center. And to you. Exhale and center. Last set here. Out. Exhale and center. Last one to you. Exhale. Come back to center. Bend the knee, lower one foot down, second leg down, turn your body face me onto our side kick, please. So onto the elbow. Legs are together, lifting the underneath waistline up. Here we go. Stretch the top leg up, dorsiflex. Let's go forward. Inhale. Center strong. Inhale. Exhale. Three more, inhale, reach back, two. And last, last, back, hold, forearm down, extend the top arm, reach the arm and the leg away in opposite direction. And bring the legs together, swing your leg over to the other side. Okay, here we go. Lifting up the underneath side, reaching the legs long, and lift up, dorsiflex, we go forward. Inhale, exhale, in breath, and three more sets, two, last, on hold, forearm down, extend, reach out, reach out, reach out, and coming down, onto a front four. A single leg kick, right, forearm down. I want you to think about lifting the abdominal off and then glide the shoulder blades down. I want you to think about shining that chest forward and up. All right now, float both legs off the floor and we go exhale, inhale, exhale, in breath, and And last set. And extend both legs long, stay. Lower the chest and reach the arms forward, head between the arms, swimming right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg. And we go, inhale for five. Exhale. In breath for five. Exhale. Three more sets. Two more. Last here. We hold and really stand right, bend the elbows forearm the side of the shoulder push off the floor and sit back to your rest position and tuck your toes under i want you to come up into your up stretch please so lift the pelvis up nice and high with the pelvis reaching the heels up head between your arms create more space in between each vertebra here now let's prance lower the right Lower the right heel, and then we switch, and we switch, and we switch, and in breath, in breath, and exhale, exhale, and in breath, in breath, and exhale, exhale, last set, and exhale, exhale, lift both heels up, lower both heels down, and stay here, in breath. And exhale, and then go ahead and walk your feet to your hands. So stepping forward, stepping forward, stepping forward, stepping forward. Fold your body 
deeper in the hip joint and let your body to dangle down. Stay in breath. Feet up parallel. Exhale and go ahead and roll the spine back up to your standing position. Lifting tall, standing nice and tall. One long inhalation with me. Exhale. And you are done. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you back on the mat tomorrow. Have a lovely day. Well done on completing this class, your star. I'm Mira and I'm here to help you to love, look and feel your absolute best through Pilates. If you enjoyed this video, you will love my free six day intermediate challenge. Click the first link in the comments and join us in getting fit, strong and feel energized with a calendar of new intermediate Pilates videos. This six day challenge is taken from my 28 days intermediate Pilates program. If you would like to join the full 28 days, you'll find a link to my Flow With Mirror online membership in the description. See you in the next class.